Asma from the Bachelor of Data Science program here at SPGen. So we recently did a project with the Amazon Web Services Deep Racer, which is basically a remoteless car, toy car essentially. It's kind of a miniature version of an actual vehicle and basically it works on the, um, on the ideas of reinforcement learning. So this is an AWS Deep Racer. It is a 116th model of a self-driving car. And we had a first-hand experience at knowing what goes under self-driving car category. So over here, as you can see, uh, there are two parts to this vehicle. The upper layer is the competition layer and the lower layer is the vehicle chasing. So this is what we did. We interacted with the upper layer, the competition layer, and we programmed the car to move in the to follow the track. So for example, if it is going straight, then we assign positive points to it. And if it is sway, uh, swaying or swerving on the track, then we assign negative. So it automatically would go towards the positive point and that's how it basically stays within the track. The time it takes to uh, train this car depends on the on the kind of track you wanted to, wanted to run on. So we went for a really basic track because this was this was our first project and so we we went for a basic oval track and even that took like two hours to train. And once this was ready, once this was ready, students from our class they put up, they put up a track using black chart papers and tapes. And this went off track quite a lot of times, even after all the training that it had, it had received. And it took us like two days to finally get it go around the track, track perfectly. So this may look like a toy, but then the applications go way beyond. The, uh, the same technology, neural networks technology. It, it's it's been used by different companies such as uh, Google to make a driverless car. Uh, Tesla has something similar to this in place, but it's way more advanced because it's already on the roads. Letting people like us work with toys like these, uh, it's the way forward because we can go we can go on and uh, work on those big projects that that, that Tesla or Google uh, has in place.